welcome to Belarusia. Yeah, first no, time. The first time here. Yeah. So we have about 45 minutes because it's John, John. Is, John is coming, so we're waiting for him. Perfect. So welcome again. Thank you. Great. Welcome, John. This is Artem. Craig already eating some food. He's not waiting for you. Good morning, we're in Belarusia with uh, John and Greg and for the bison hunt today, European bison uh, then we have another plan for another animal anyway so the, the strong folk, let's say, yes guys? Yeah, strong Heavy folk, folk yes. yes like, honestly, it's not easy to see and honestly, we didn't see anything I think it's not because of folk Maybe animal just stay in the forest today or visit some food and back. The bison. We realize that it's going, is going from that place to the field. Uh, to the field, and as we realize, it just go inside. Like his track show us that animal go inside, and probably it was at night. So with John today, and Greg today, we realized that all the morning we was driving the car, the watching, and uh, because of fog, we cannot see exactly what's going on inside because probably. Probably the same animal inside, but guys, how to see? How to see? Even the term vision not help us too much because the terms even cannot see more than 300 meters. And you see, so of course the animals everywhere here, but what only we need to we need to find it. Can you see that? Yes, even see. Yes, we still we try to see at least, but morning was like this and we continue our hunt in Belarusia let's see hunting is hunting we try Good morning guys, 
so it's only fog everywhere we start about seven o'clock morning in Belarus and now for the bison really really strong fog we uh, visit three places we still see nothing but we continue our hunt I think you should. Yeah, yeah, I think you should. So we think, John, we, we heard, we heard the probably. Oh, we hit him. We yeah, him good. Yeah. 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 So, wow, yes, looks like. like hammer. Yeah. You found it? Yeah. Dead? Yeah. Here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yes. yes. John, congratulations, John. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh my yeah. god! Big <laughs> Okay, you take out the hat, John? Yeah. Yes, yes. See, it must have been a new hat. Yes, it's it's like traditional. Yep, very European. A European in, in the Belarusian as well, you see? Mm -hmm. This is like traditional here, guys. Yeah. It was a challenge because of the fog that we had. Yeah. But then this afternoon the wind picked up a bit and we split. Yeah. We had two cars yeah. going. And Alexander, the game guard, calls and goes, duh, duh, duh. So we came over here and we snuck in real quiet and there was a herd of about 20 in here. We had a great stock going and then something scared them, Asif. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was me. And then they ran down low and we didn't give up. We continued yeah. down, Yuri dragged me down there. Yeah. And we got down right before they went in, maybe 50 yards before they got in. This guy was in the back, and then all of a sudden he started moving forward. I'm going, oh! Yeah. But but then you should remember we heard that like, boom. Oh like, yeah. And, that, then, yeah. and then Yuri set the sticks up. Yeah. And I got on, thought it was about 200, held, and boom. Um, and you could hear the whack, and you yeah. could see him. You remember we start to run to to run to the second shoot, but but, but then the forest. then they were in the forest and Milan yeah. going oh no because <laughs> if you were less, less yeah. with me last year yeah, you yeah. know that I wounded oh, one yeah, right, yeah, at you dark, remember. right at dark and we never but found now, him. But now now you see finally John congratulations yeah, from I'm us very, to you it's your he's bison beautiful. European bison and uh, looks like good oh, shot he, by the way he's beautiful yeah man it's a good shot good shot bam good shot good shot. Good shot. What a relief, Asif. And he's a beautiful, yeah. old, old, 15 plus year old. Good morning, John. Good, Good morning, morning, Greg. How are you? How's it going? So, we change, we change our We're place. We're going to go to a new area today. A new animal. So, yeah, it's now it's your time also. Now I'm home. ready. But it's a sad day to leave this place. It's a yes. pretty, for hunting, it's pretty fancy. And for staying also. <laughs> for staying, sleeping, showers. Yeah. So, John, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm ready.
It was interesting. Thank you. Good, good talk. It was interesting, Greg. So, your fellow deer in Belarus. <laughs> I like it, man. I do too. I don't like my shooting today, but I love the hunting. Yes, you're shooting the guys like rifle, the bullets, you see, and first it was training for us for the meat. <laughs> so it's good, man. It's good. Uh, thank you, Oscar. <laughs> good, good. Just, just made several steps, let's say. One shot, two shot. I'm fucking all over the place. John, where is your congratulation to, to Craig? I just did. It's right there. It's beautiful. For European tradition, for European tradition, let me congratulate you with your trophy. Three веточки. Three. Одна символизирует меткое попадание. Is first is like your shooting. Вторая символизирует последнюю пищу для животного. Is the last food, the last food for the animal and respect to him. Yes, sir. Третья отмечается кровью добытого животного. Почетный знак. Ею поздравляется. And it's like celebration. Стрелок. И congratulations for you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Should I put it in here? Yes. 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 This uh, actually is a, a very important animal for me. <clears throat> I'm here with my good friend John. Uh, I got to hunt with Sergey and Artyom, and of course Asif, my old and new friend. But uh, this is a very important animal for me. I've been fortunate enough to hunt around the world for many, many years, and been to Africa, I'm not sure, but 30-something times. Uh, but I've never gotten to hunt and experience hunting in Europe. So this is my very first trophy from Europe and he'll always be the first and always be cherished. And uh, for sure I will hunt Europe again. So hopefully I get to hunt Belarus again. So it was uh, quite a privilege and I've done better shooting in my day, but we got him on the ground and he's going to Texas. So very, very happy. Thank you. Thank you to everyone. So Sometimes like this, old one, old We need older, older yes. animals. Yeah, 100%. Percent. So we need old because I need. Yeah. Вышки раз. 
расположены примерно не вышки, а штанды, не высокие, не высокие, они расположены примерно каждые 200-250 метров. Они имеют стендинг, который они имеют, и 200 метров от всех, 200-200. Мы сейчас будем идти против ветра. Если будем видеть зверя, который нас устраивает к добыче, и до вышки будет далеко, будем пробовать стрелять с палок. Но если зверь будет себя вести спокойно, будет находиться далеко, то мы будем стараться подходить к вышкам, где можно занять устойчивую позицию и спокойно выстрелить на более дальнюю дистанцию. Like now, if it will be a little bit far, probably we can put stay in the stand and take position for shooting because it's good for like for long stay. shoot yeah. stay yeah. because yeah. so this is this is explanation. Yeah. Yeah. Если дистанция будет короткая, там в районе 100-150 метров, да, там, ну до 200, мы yeah. будем пробовать стрелять с палок, либо где-то к дереву прислонимся, либо где-то на землю. Если дистанция длинная, мы всегда можем подойти чуть поближе подняться на вышку сверху будет удобнее видно стрелять ну вот как-то так вам in distance 100 150 even 200 we can use our slow yes. stick if if longer we come to we come to the close for us which is stand we stand there and try shoot from there this is our plan for today с палок мы будем стрелять только при том условии если зверь начнет двигаться уходить когда мы будем видеть что шансов у нас depends on situation if it tries so follow around for we will see we will see это для, 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 для дистанционного боя. Если, если будут нападать звери, то будем отстреливаться. <laughs> Just finds this, so it's like yeah, you're, yeah, you're exactly yeah, trophy. Yeah. You're looking for another for side, so good for you. о чем мы разговаривали, что когда он становится старым, yeah. лопата yeah. начинает разваливаться. В следующем году она могла еще лопнуть. It will be more. The next year it will be open like here is more. So yes. with the older animal она became a Sometimes in three part of the horn. So great job. Congratulations. Congratulations, man. Thank you, man. Спасибо. <laughs> Вам спасибо. Приезжайте еще. What a fantastic way to end this hunting year. Here it is, the end of November, and we're in Belarus. 
I've traveled more than 125,000 miles this year hunting, and I couldn't be happier with ending it in Belarus. We've had a fantastic trip. I came with my good friends Asif and Craig Phillips, and we've had a fantastic time. We've made many new friends, we've had some incredible food, and the hunting is fantastic. I, could, I came for a bison and shot a monster two days ago in the fog, just like you see today. And now we're here, uh, just north of Minsk, and we're hunting fallow deer. And I was lucky enough to spot this guy sneaking in amongst the herd, and we put a, with, uh, we made a great stock on him, and a 160 meter shot, uh, two of them, not one, but two shots. And anyway, it's just been fantastic. I can't speak enough of, you know, the help that everybody's been and the animals and quality of trophies that we've seen. It's just been absolutely incredible. Anyway, thank you. Вот такая охота в Беларуси. Сначала приехал и носить заставляю. him away from the trough. Today we uh, decided to try for a mouflon and we saw several that we tried to stalk on foot and they were uh, just too quick for us and we couldn't catch them so we tried a, a, a stand hunt and uh, Right away we saw them in the background and this one came in with some of the other animals and uh, ate, in which uh, it's a little bit different kind of style of hunting but it uh, proved very successful and it's a beautiful, beautiful move on and uh, I couldn't be happier. It's a, it's a right in the forest in the middle of Belarus and uh, kind of a cloudy overcast day but a perfect temperature for hunting, a great day to be outdoors, and it's just a privilege to uh, get to hunt here, and thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.